huge political news today in Montana. The New York Times is reporting Governor Steve Bullock is poised to enter the U.S. Senate race to challenge Republican Senator Steve Daines. MTN chief political reporter Mike Dennison has been following the story as well and has more. Governor Bullock has been telling people for months he had no interest in challenging Senator Daines this year. But in the past month, National Democrats have upped the pressure on him to run with personal contacts by former President Obama and Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer. The Times attributed its scoop today to unnamed top Democratic officials, but they're not the only ones saying Bullock will jump into the race. Multiple sources have told MTN News this week that they expect him to announce on Monday, the last day for candidate filing, that he has changed his mind and will enter the contest. We called Bullock on Tuesday evening, but he had yet to reply today. And neither the governor nor anyone close to him has confirmed his plans. Bullock was in Los Angeles today to pitch Montana as a film location and to meet with film producers and industry officials. National Republicans have been prepping for months for a possible Bullock candidacy and wasted no time today unloading on the Democratic governor. The National Republican Senatorial Committee said he lacks the character and values Montanans expect from a senator and cited his support for impeaching President Trump. But Montana state political scientist David Parker told MTN News that Bullock's presence on the ballot would be a huge benefit to Democrats up and down the Montana ticket, bringing millions of dollars of campaign resources into the state. Make no mistake, if Bullock does get into the Senate race, it goes from a few million dollars to tens of millions, one of the most expensive U.S. Senate contests in the country. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. Three other largely unknown Democrats are already in the Senate race. If Bullock enters, he'd be a clear favorite to win the primary.